Welcome back, Bears. I'm Bryson reporting from the BTV studio. Today is Friday, November 17th, and we only have today before the Thanksgiving break. Plus, it's game day for our Bears football team. Hope you attended last night's pep rally for our Bears football team going into the second round of the playoffs. It was only second night pep rally and great send off for our Bears. Here's a shout out to our Bear Harmony Choir for singing the national anthem at our night pep rally to help our Bears football team gear up for the game. Today they travel to San Juan to take on the Far San Juan Bears. Yes, it's a bear showdown, so BFND Bears. If you can't make the game today, you can live stream it beginning at 6 p.m. Just scan this QR code. And visit us on Twitter at BTV Bears for highlights of their runaway 37-0 win versus Laredo United South last Friday in their bi-district playoff win. Now for basketball. Our Lady Bears basketball team scored two more wins yesterday against the Floresville Jaguar Classic. In the morning, the ladies took on the Young Women's Leadership Academy and walked away with a 61-23 win. In the afternoon, Our Lady Bears then scored a second win over Houston Second Baptist 64-38. Let's wish them well as they take on Alamo Heights today and continue competing in Floresville through tomorrow. Let's also wish our Bears basketball team lots of luck as they compete at the McDonald's Texas Invitational Tournament in Pasadena. BFND Bears teams. Once more, thanks to all who donated the gift of life at the HOSA and JROTC's blood drive to support their programs this past Tuesday. Now for academic news. If you are interested in new to dual credit, Please note you must take the TSI assessment. You can register on myschoolbucks.com and the testing window remains open through April 25, 2024. To register, create an account, log in, and under school store, scroll to filter test and exam fees. You should be able to see TSI assessment. Take advantage of this. Coach Shelley Strickland students continue learning about the zones of the ocean and the challenges of living in the deep sea where pressure is extreme and it's completely dark. They learned how bioluminescence can be a helpful adaptation to see organisms and communicate, attract mates, and use it to confuse attackers. Interesting. Finally, Bears, let's get into the spirit of giving by donating a blanket to the Herrick Humane Society. If interested, you can drop off a blanket in English teacher Javier Cavazos' classroom, E238. Our student council blanket drop-off begins Monday, November 27th and runs through Friday, December 1st. Buy a blanket, Bears, and drop it off. This is all we have for today, and don't forget to follow us on Twitter, at BTV Bears. And if you missed any part of this broadcast, catch us on YouTube by searching for BTV Bears. If you have any announcements for BTV, please email Mr. Cerna at fernando.cerna at nasd.net. I'm Bryson signing off from BTV. Have a great day, Bears, and let's keep a positive mindset, stay engaged in our learning, and continue to evolve every day. Enjoy and have a happy Thanksgiving break. This is a BTV production.